I believe most people like to eat luncheon meat, right? Today, we'll make rice cooker, luncheon meat braised rice. This recipe is easy to make. This recipe save a lot of time in busy times. Follow my channel and save this recipe too. Refer anytime you like in the future. There is no limit to the ingredients for stewed rice, as long as cutting ingredients into equal sizes can prevent some ingredients from being undercooked. You may select luncheon meat flavor you like. Optional to add mala luncheon meat to have spicy taste for your braised rice. Let's start cooking now. Rice Potato Luncheon meat Carrot Cubes carrot Cubes potato Cubes onion Heat oil Stir fry ingredients One tablespoon oyster sauce. One teaspoon light soy sauce. One teaspoon salt. Black pepper. Optional to add chicken powder. Add rice and stir fry. Dark soy sauce to add color. Pour water for rice cooking. Select rice button. Rice is cooked. Mix well. Smells so good. Let's eat luncheon meat braised rice now. Each bites with luncheon meat taste and crunchy onion sweetness. So delicious. YouTube friends who like cooking may consider following my YouTube channel for more delicious recipes. If you can please give me a like which is the greatest encouragement to me. Thank you all. I like easy recipe because I believe that delicious food must be simple and quick to prepare. After all, there are so many things going on every day, right? Don't forget to follow my channel so you can refer the recipes anytime you like in the future. Duchi is a seasoning made from whole, fermented black beans with black particles. On the outside, it can add minced garlic or chili pepper to make tempeh sauce. Traditional Chinese fermented soybean seasonings It is a traditional Chinese fermented soybean seasoning. The Japanese once called tempeh nachi, and later it specifically referred to the sugar natto invented in Japan. Tempeh is also commonly consumed in Southeast Asian countries, but is less popular in Europe and the United States. 
Duchi contains a variety of nutrients which can improve the flora of the gastrointestinal tract, detoxify various medicinal and food poisons. Let's use duchi to fried rice. Everyone knows that fried rice requires overnight rice, but are you confused as to why overnight rice is used? Compared with freshly cooked rice, the surface of overnight rice will become drier after the water evaporates overnight, so that after frying, the rice grains will absorb the oil in the pot and separate more easily. According to this principle, freshly cooked rice can also produce the effect of overnight rice. In fact, the steps are simple. Just wait for it to cool down. Overnight rice. Duchi. Chili potty. Onion. Carrot. Chopped garlic. Cubes carrot. Cubes onion. Chopped chili potty. Heat oil. Stir fry onion until translucent. One teaspoon chopped garlic. Duchi. Chili potty. Carrot cubes. Overnight rice. Season with one teaspoon light soy sauce. Plate. Duchi fried rice is done. This duchi fried rice is so easy. Duchi fried rice is delicious with duchi saltiness, mixed with onion crunchy and sweetness. YouTube Friends who like cooking may consider following my YouTube channel for more delicious recipes. If you can please give me a like which is the greatest encouragement to me. Thank you all. I like easy recipes because I believe that delicious food must be simple and quick to prepare. After all, there are so many things going on every day, right? I often use the same ingredients for variations, suitable for small families to cook with one ingredient, come up with two or even three different dishes. Don't forget to follow my channel so you can refer the recipes anytime you like in the future. 
Thanks for watching. See you in next video ya. Bye bye.